Right guys, um, I've put my head on, I've put my coach's head on, that's what I like to call it, so I can look the most like I work in the NFL possible. But unfortunately, I, I won't be. Uh, not just yet anyway. So the title of this video is talking about, well, it's actually a follow-up to a previous video that I made talking about an application that I put in on a whim. You know, it was, uh, I, I guess it was a, a last minute decision. It was a, a desperate decision. You know, I'd come home from an interview, job interview, the first that I had here in Rockhampton, and I have applied for many more jobs, but none of them have come through since. Uh, so I, I didn't have my hopes pinned on this or anything. It was an internship anyway. I, 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 I'm led to believe that you don't get paid anything. So anyways, um, bit of a desperate decision, you know, thinking, shit, am I going to be working for someone that doesn't appreciate me or my talents or for a company that I am literally completely and utterly uninterested in for the rest of my life? And I thought, no, no, I'm not going to do that. So what, where do I want to work? What environment do I want to work in? And I've told this to many people, and that is the professional sports environment. Professional sports environment. Whether that be rugby, whether that be American football, whether that be basketball, whether that be the UFC, I would love nothing more than to put my passion and put my talents into something that I'm fucking behind. You know what I mean? And so that's what led me to look up for the very first time careers in the NFL. And I found a website that the NFL teams advertise their jobs through. And I can't exactly remember what it's called, but before we continue, I'm going to get up the response email. Because as the title of this video suggests, yes, I finally got a response. I got a response from the Jacksonville Jags through this website about my job application. So let me get that up. The organization they go through is called Teamwork Online. Teamwork Online Employment. And so I finally got a, an email back. I feel like I sent... The original application must have been about a month ago, if not a little bit more. And uh, look, I will say that even though the Jacksonville Jags follow me on Instagram, even though a lot of you guys, or a couple of you guys, a lot of you guys gave me the support I needed, a couple of you guys reshared the video, a couple of you guys sent the, sent the video through to some people that may have a little bit of, you know, um, sway of the decision in these type of things, but nothing worked. And in fact, I heard absolutely zip. I heard zero words, zero replies, zero anything from anyone involved in the Jacksonville Jags. And the only reply I got, which I'm happy I got, you know what I mean? Because there's nothing worse than not even hearing back from a job application. We've all been there. And I simply, you know, I, I, <laughs> I expected that. I expected never to hear anything back from them due to the fact that I didn't actually put a huge amount of effort into the application, which is my bad, but like I said at the start, it was a last minute decision and if I wasn't going to put in an application that night, it probably would never have happened. So at least I put something in. At least my name was in the hat. But anyways, it reads, Events and Entertainment Intern, Jacksonville Jags in Jacksonville, Florida. Jacob, we want to thank you for your interest in the above mentioned position. We had many fine applicants for the position, including you. Oh, cheers, guys. However, we have filled the position with someone whose background and credentials we feel best meet our needs at this time. We welcome you to apply for any future positions we have available that match your skills and experience. Sincerely, the hiring manager for events and entertainment intern, Jacksonville Jags. So, there is a hiring manager, I'm led to believe. And I guess if I really want to go for the Jags, that is the person I want to target. I want to reach them directly. So what I'm going to say, guys, is that no, the application wasn't accepted. And no, I probably wouldn't have been able to go over there anytime soon due to the pandemic that we're in, unfortunately, and due to the fact that I have just arrived here in Rockhampton. But what I do know now is that there are jobs out there. It's possible. And I firmly believe that if I put the time and effort needed into another application for another job that pops up, I'm definitely going to be in a better position. I'm definitely going to be more likely to at least make a short list, possibly even get an interview, and who knows what will happen. So I certainly um, feel thankful. I definitely feel thankful that they've gotten back to me through this Teamwork Online employment. And uh, I guess the only thing left to do now is to continue to check the page. In fact, 
since, I must say, I, I, I give a lot of credit to these guys, Teamwork Online, because ever since applying for that first job, they've actually sent me like almost on a weekly basis other jobs that I might be interested in. And there have been other jobs that I've been interested in. And actually, three days ago, there was another job. The Summer Analytics Associate, which I haven't actually looked at yet, so I'm gonna click on that right now. Analytics, I love analytics. Let's see what this is about. Financial, okay, it's in Accounting and Finance. Financial Data Analyst. The Summer Analytics Associate will work in the analytics department with a focus on researching topics related to the football and or business components of the Jacksonville Jaguars. The analytics team is responsible for analyzing, interpreting, presenting, and communicating data to enhance processes, decision-making, and outcomes for the Jacksonville Jaguars. Are you hearing what I'm hearing? <laughs> this is a paid, seasonal, full-time position for the 2021 summer. Start end dates are flexible. Application deadline is April the 5th, 2021. Okay, job responsibilities. Let's do it, mate. This is... Shit, this sounds even better than the other one. Define specific research questions after gaining an understanding of the department's broader areas of interest. Investigate research topics through data-driven quantitative analysis. Engineer automated processes for reproducible metrics and predictions. Create reports and dashboards to effectively convey insights and recommendations to a variety of audiences. And last but not least, Collaborate with a manager to focus research around areas of personal interest and technical skills development. Okay, job requirements. Experience with Dipla or Python for data cleaning, analysis and predictive modeling. So that just must be various software that uh, data entry is included. I mean, shit, I did data entry for a job for many years. Ability to assess problems to plan and execute creative yet rigorous solutions with acute attention to detail. Well, I've got that. Effective written and verbal communication of, of both technical and non-technical concepts. I back my written and verbal communication. And a passion for creating visually pleasing and informative work products. And I love a good Excel spreadsheet. I tell you what, if I hadn't have made this video today, I would have missed that. I would have missed that job. But I'm telling you right now, that seems like an absolute fit with a deadline for applications in a week and a flexible start time. We're talking summer and summer's coming up in a few months. Would I be able to go over there with the way that the world is at the moment? Maybe not, but I think that's at the very least worth putting together a proper application and sending through just to see, just to show them exactly what I'm about to tell them exactly what skills I can offer. I mean, that's right up my alley. That is right up my alley. So guys, that was a turn of events. I wasn't expecting that. But basically this video is about just updating you all on how the application went. Um, there was almost 6,000 viewers of that video. You know, people got behind me. 6,000 viewers, 600 likes. There's not many videos about me and my personal life that get that many views or that much support. So I wanna say, first and foremost, thank you so much to everyone out there for supporting. We didn't get this one over the line, but I'm gonna put another application in. And when I do, I'm gonna make another video. So, Summer Analytics Associate with the Jacksonville Jags. Why not? The real question is, guys, why the fuck not? So I'll see you in the next one. And thanks for watching. Peace out.